Hi everyone, my name is JD Slacker, and I'm so honored and privileged to be bringing to you this year's Luke Bodden Day announcements. And our word for this year is the word strong. Because although Luke embodied many different qualities, such as persevering through many hardships, always having a smile on his face, and being a beam of light to the Oak Park community, maybe nothing is more representative and telling of who he really was than just being strong. Now, I met Luke when I was only 17 years old and I was a senior at Oak Park High School and Luke was six at the time and he used to go to all of my basketball games. And when I met Luke, his sister came up to me and explained to me that Luke had never missed a single game and that the last thing that he wanted to do before he went into the hospital for a full year of isolation for a bone marrow transplant was to meet me and play basketball with me. Now, Luke suffered from something called sickle cell disease, and the only known cure for sickle cell disease is a bone marrow transplant, where Luke originally was told he'd have to be in isolation for three months, and that actually ended up being an entire year. Through this connection, Luke and I ended up certainly building a very strong friendship ourselves all the way until he tragically passed away on September 14th. 2016 at the age of 10. Now, in this Oak Park community, we remember Luke and we remember all of the amazing things he stood for during his 10 years of life. It's such an honor and a privilege for me to talk about my best friend in this way and bring you guys this year's message of strong because I know how many of you have been through a lot of a different and odd circumstances through this last year. Going to school online, being away from friends and family for holidays. These were things that Luke went through during his year of isolation as well. So at the Luke Strong community, we wanted to make this year's Luke Bodden Day word strong because we all have hardships and things that we're going through. Um, but it is important to remember that if we continue to remain strong, we can get through anything. I personally watched Luke go through some of the hardest battles I'd ever seen anyone go through in my whole life, and he was only a little kid. But he always managed to remain positive, keep a smile on his face, and even sometimes encourage others. It can be challenging. It can be challenging to be stuck in our own skin and feel like we don't have all the things going our way or we have real problems going on. But the thing that Luke always did for me was to remind me that we are so fortunate to be dealing with the things that we feel like are problems. Luke meant so much to not just me, but as I said, this entire Oak Park community at large, and he really was the heartbeat and family dynamic that is the Oak Park Unified School District. So as we remember him today, I want you all to remember to be strong no matter what it is that you're going through, because we can always be doing a better job of just that. So thank you, everyone. It was my pleasure to be speaking to you all today, and may you always be Luke Strong forever.